Hi, this is Shannon from Canada Wig, and I just wanted to do a quick video to talk about two different methods that you can use to secure your wig to your head. Um, if you're feeling a little bit self-conscious about going out in with windy weather or you're planning to pull your hair back into a ponytail or other styles and you just are really worried that it's going to move around, then these are great ways to help keep your wig on in place where you want it. Um, so the first method we have here is the It Stays Body Adhesive. So this particular product, it's it's kind of like a glue, but it's water soluble, so it's it's not gonna glue your wig to your head forever. Don't worry about that. <laughs> um, and it just comes in a roll-up ball, so you're just gonna roll that on the hairline wherever you want it. Um, you could roll it like quite a bit around your head if you really want maximum security. But uh, I found that just even rolling this just on the 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 front of the hairline here, and then putting the wig on will give me the the stay that I need. I don't need anything more than that. So. I mean, everybody has their own preferences. Um, the nape might be one other place I suggest possibly doing it, especially if you're gonna pull your hair back in a ponytail, but um, generally speaking, this, this stuff is really great and it holds really well. And it just, you just kind of peel the wig off once you're finished and then you just rinse it with water, rinse your hair with water, rinse the, uh, the wig, the area that had the it stays on with water and then you're pretty much good to go. So that is one method if you want to um, avoid using anything on your head. And I should note that um, I've been using it for about a year and I haven't found that it's pulling out my bio hair at all. So if you are someone who's, you know, trying to minimize the additional loss you get with your bio hair, um, this is a good method and I don't think you'll have any issues. The second method is the uh, the wig grip. So this band um, is basically, it's, it's not going to be something that you're actually applying to your head. You just wrap it around and you can take it off whenever you need to. So it's a little bit less, I guess, messy than this one. Um, I wouldn't say that this is messy by any means, but it is a product you're putting on your hair. So with this one, you're just gonna take it and you're gonna have the um, this uh, label here on the outside of your head, on the right-hand side, and you're just gonna put it around your head like that, obviously under the wig, <laughs> um, unless you really like that look and you wanna go over, but I think under is better <laughs> and serves the purpose. But uh, yeah, so you just put that under and then you wrap it around and you put the Velcro on, you, you just close it with the Velcro. And then once that's secure in place, you wanna make sure that it's sitting um, just a little bit past where your natural hairline would be. Then you put on the wig cap and then you just uh, make sure it's all hidden and, and under like that in place and um, you're pretty much set to go. So that's gonna keep your wig on. This material is very, it sticks to your bio hair and then it also sticks to the wig cap. So it just kind of creates that suction um, that is gonna make sure that wig isn't, isn't gonna go anywhere. As you can see, I'm pulling on this and it's just staying exactly where it needs to be. So it's a very secure and um, it does it does give you, if you're someone who notices a bit of itching with your cap, you might find that this can help because it does pre create that extra soft layer between the cap and your skin. So that is something to keep in mind. Um, some people may find the opposite and you might find that this itches you even more. Um, generally speaking, it's quite comfortable. I have it on right now and uh, it's, it's not causing me any issues, but it's kind of a personal preference thing there. And these are very easy to wash. You just take it off and then rinse it with water. Uh, wash it in cold water, I believe. So uh, yeah, very easy to maintain and very easy to use. Um, if you're gonna pick up a color, it does come in black and brown and uh, beige. So you wanna probably try and match the color of the band to your wig. And that will help um, if you have a monofilament just to make sure that you're not seeing the band there underneath it. And then apart from that, I mean, these are great alternatives to adding clips. Clips are always an, an option you can use in wigs, but the, the downside you run with the clips is that it can cause traction and that, and that can cause hair loss. So um, if you are looking to, you know, minimize hair loss and also just minim like have it be as comfortable as possible, I think that um, one of these two solutions is definitely going to be your better choice. So this is two different ways that you can attach your wig to your head. I hope this was helpful. Um, if you want to see more of these videos, please subscribe to our channel because we're going to do more on a regular basis. Hope you have a good day.